This is Robert here with another Tech Geek 311 pre-Apple event. Now I know I already covered a pre-Apple event back in September. That was for the release of the iPhone 6 as well as uh, we got a release date for iOS 8. But as always every year Apple does two events. One in September and one in October. Now we're in October now is time for the next Apple event. So this event's going to be held this Thursday, which is actually tomorrow, October 16th. It'll be 10 a.m. California time, noon for Texas time. So I'm going to give you my uh, pre-event broadcast video so that there's no confusions when I do the live broadcasting. All right, so this event that's going to be held tomorrow on the 16th is going to cover the new iPads. So now Apple's going to go over iPads, and they're going to go over their Macs, uh, possibly the release date of iOS 8.1, which will include the Apple Pay, and also the release date of OS X Yosemite for the Macs. So we'll get an, a better idea of that. <clears throat> what we're unsure of is a 12.9 inch iPad. We don't know if that's going to be announced. We don't know if there's going to be any information on an Apple TV, and we're really unsure if there's going to be any information on an iPod. That's stuff that's all in the rumor mills right now. We don't know yet. But I want to let you guys know, when I do my live broadcasting, now it's not a live stream. I cannot show you guys the live stream of the event. Um, apparently YouTube has the, the rules on that, so I can't do that. I'm going to show you what's called a live broadcast. Now what I can do is if there's any live blogging going on during the event, which means the people that are in California themselves, that I can broadcast to you guys which I didn't do last time, which was my mistake. I didn't know I had that programming feature allowed. But now I know that I can. Mm. With this event, I will do the uh, the live broadcasting and the live blogs that are going on at the time. So basically what you'll do is you'll get a screen of me talking and then you'll get a screen showing you the live blog itself. So when they announce <clears throat> what the new iPads are, you'll be able to see what they are. Uh, any other new little demos or features, whatever's going on, you'll be able to see those as, as they go through. Now, last event in September, Apple made a big mistake as far as their live streaming. It, it really messed up, didn't work. Wasn't my fault, it was the fault of the live streaming. So I'm hoping that this event will be better and it will stream better. But if there are technical difficulties, I don't want to leave you guys in the air just watching me the whole time. I will be searching around for my live bloggers and see who I can actually broadcast to show you guys. So I will try to comment as best I can, try to give you the live broadcasting feeds so that you guys can see what's going on, uh, and hopefully the event will go well. But as, as always, anything live is going to have mistakes. You're not going to have it perfect like these recorded videos that we do now. If it's a live event, expect mistakes, expect technical difficulties, expect problems, expect those things because it's a live event. So that's going to be my pre, or this is actually, this is my pre video. That's, this is my introduction to my uh, live broadcasting for tomorrow. So that you guys know that. Now, <clears throat> we might also get a, a actual release date on either the iPad Air 2 and iPad Mini 3. Uh, we're not sure yet at this point, but we do know it's an iPad event. Not sure if they're going to go through iMacs and Mac Minis and MacBook Pros or MacBook Airs. That that we're we know it's going to be a Mac, but we're not sure which which one they're going to actually tweak or update. We don't know if the iPod is dead yet. That's all up in the air at this point. And we're going to see if there's anything mentioning about a refresh of an Apple TV or even the Airport Extremes. They've never ex mentioned any of those at all, so we don't know yet at this point. So, when you guys tune in, uh, it'll be about 11.30 Texas time. I'll actually do my live broadcasting about 10 minutes to that, about 11.50. It'll start noon Texas time, probably go till about 2 p.m. Texas time. So it's usually about a two-hour event. So uh, if you guys log in, it'll be on YouTube. It'll also be on uh, Google Hangouts uh, on air. So you have those two sources you can, you can see that. Okay, so this is my pre-event. So we have no confusions, uh, no uh, problems, none of these haters like I get on YouTube. I want you guys to know exactly what's going on. I'm not live streaming, I'm live broadcasting. So you will see me, but you'll also see my live blogs as they go through because I'm going to add that in this time. Alright, so I hope you guys all tune in. I uh, hope you guys like this video. 
subscribe if you haven't because I've sent out a notice to all my subscribers and I will catch you guys then on the 16th for this live Apple event. Alright, have a good one.